welcome to another vlog. It's so good to see you again. Woo, guys, welcome to another vlog. Welcome to another drama. I am currently in Kigali, as you guys saw. Um, I'm in Rwanda. And yeah, I'm going to be here for a week. As you guys can see, I'm getting ready. So... Yeah, man, get ready with me while I catch you guys up on um, what I'm doing and uh, like my experience so far. So first of all, yesterday was just, uh, okay, today's Monday. I arrived here last night. Actually, I arrived here this morning. Um, I left home at around 8.40 um, to go to the airport. I caught my flight, which was at 9.40. And then I arrived in Joburg an hour later. Great, ne? I get to Joburg, I'm thinking, okay, I'm gonna lounge, you know? I lounge, because I had a five hour layover. I'm like, I'll lounge, no problem, you know? I'm good. Then they tell me they can't take my bag. They can't check in my bag because, um, yeah, they're not open yet and that I should come back at half past one. So I left and went to a restaurant, sat there and tried to catch up on some work and you know it was okay then fine we left eventually so we first that flight so we we used rwanda which is the um, saa of rwanda and that flight went to zambia so we had a stop over another stop over in or stop rather in in zambia and then we stopped for about 30 40 minutes and then we left for kigali so it's like and it's i think without the stop it would have been four hours because it's two hours to lusaka and then another two hours to kigali right we get to the hotel no i'm lying we get to um i don't have a, a big mirror so i'm literally trying to fit in this one I'm just brushing my my um what's this my eyebrows um so guys i'm still telling you we get to the airport when I tell you, we waited for our bags for literally an hour, one whole hour of standing. And the funniest thing is that our conveyor belt will stop and people that just landed will get their bags and leave. So it was just a weird situation. And then sharp, nah, as if the hour was not enough, we literally waited another hour for the hotel transfers to come and pick us up to the hotel. And there was a lot of us, so we had to literally wait. We waited for a very long time. We left the airport at like half past 11 at night. Remember guys, we landed at 21.35 now. An hour, 30 minutes later, we left the airport. And I'm not even going to lie and say it's the immigration. The immigration was so quick and sufficient. And I'm going to give Rwanda 10 out of 10 for that one. But all these other services are just... Wow. Guys, when I tell you, I'm Nico right okay so this is my o otd um my hair is slicked into a bun i don't know how to hold this anyway and then this dress is a dress i got from h&m and i'm wearing the these she oh my word we don't even have a long mirror i'm wearing these um leather strap shoes and they are quite comfortable they're from they are from witchery i got them like two three years ago and yeah that's my outfit you guys i think i look cute for somebody that's had a rough night um yeah let's go and meet the other peeps i don't think i'm gonna take my phone i'm gonna go for breakfast but i don't think i'm gonna take my phone and vlog i will vlog for you guys so the congress is is um I'll, I'll vlog for you guys when the congress has ended and now I can relax because I don't want to put my phone in people's faces and, you know, be extra like that. I'm going to go find Nanji. Nanji's here. Siwe's here, guys. We'll meet Siwe and, yeah, some of my friends. Check you later. So welcome back to the channel again. As you can see, my mood has improved. I'm so happy. I complained. I told you guys they moved me to another hotel um, room, which I'm just going to give you a quick... Um, sorry my thing is wobbly i'm just gonna give you a quick room tour of the new room guys i was so depressed like my mood was down because like yours if your space is not nice now you can't really live your best life so okay so this is the new room 
um as you guys can see it's way better it's much better it's more modern i can't believe these people were trying me in that direction excuse my bag yeah but this is the bed this is the new bed and as you guys can see they don't have the frills anymore guys guys never settle that is literally the lesson of the day never ever settle for anything less than what you feel you deserve okay so this is what it looks like so so much better look at the bathroom you guys like ah uh, i mean if you know african hotels you know that this is literally the best because i didn't understand how this got a five four to five star rating look at how big the bathroom is i am <laughs> And there's a full mirror. Oh my god. Sis, I'm happy Sham Donaville. There you go, guys. There's a net there. Oh, and the view. Let me show you the view. Initially, I didn't even have, couldn't even open my balcony. But look at the view, you guys. That is Rwanda in its glory. I can't wait to see this at night. Oh my word, this is so beautiful. This is the beautiful city. Now, now darling, now we can speak about me being in Rwanda because wow, when you go, you guys, like, I was not happy, like, can you imagine, I was tired from last night and obviously I didn't want to like complain all the time and be a negative person and so, they're happy now, now I'm happy, now I'm actually in Rwanda, guys, welcome. Bye, I'll see you guys. Oh, tonight we're going to a, an opening ceremony of the Congress. Um, yeah, so tonight's the opening ceremony. I still don't know if I'll take you guys with me. I would rather vlog like my personal events. I don't want to put people on cameras and whatever. So I'll check you guys whenever. Guys, I know I said that I'm not going to vlog, but I just want you guys to see um, Kigali at night. We are at a rooftop bar. And it's just a cocktail um, welcome event that we are having. And thanks everyone. And this is what we've been having so far. Yo guys, this was literally 2,000 years later. I didn't really have time to pick up the vlog again. But this was the first night out in Kigali. We went on motorcycles. When I tell you this was literally the most exhilarating experience, it was really, really good. A good time and I got to see the rest of Kigali and I got to see the town for the first time and yeah that was that Yeah, this is a good time I think for us to catch up and you know so today I am going to the market with Siway you guys haven't met him yet you'll see him he's one of my friends one of my very good friends and yeah so we're going to the market of course I'm gonna take you guys with apparently you guys this market has um, a, like a tailoring section where you can literally choose um, what you want like you can choose a design that you want and they make it for you in an hour like how cool is that so i've got this dress that i'm gonna make this like t-shirt dress that i saw um um somebody wearing that i really really liked and they told me they got it at the market i'm like what do you mean of course i'm getting it and then i'm gonna make um a beautiful um i'm gonna make beautiful pants like traditional pants with like a crop top like high-waisted pants with a matching crop top guys i'm so excited i'm very terrible my mom was like why don't you make dresses but like i'm absolutely terrible with like designs and stuff but i'm gonna just go online quickly and see what i can get but for now let me shower and then i'll see you guys on the streets <laughs> Are you sure? Have you been here? No. Oh my god. Do you want to say hi to the vlog? Sure. 
Guys, we at the market. Let's see where. Ah. They don't see you. They're just seeing your grey hair. No, it's your fault. It's me. I'm saying hi. I'm here. No, 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 no. Man. What's a wow? Well, basically, we want to find a section that doesn't no, sell no, no, food. No. Mm. Oh, it's, it's, it's divided into sections. This is nice though because they literally like sell their own produce, next. Huh? It's so tropical. Yeah. That's what I like about a lot of African countries. Further north. Yeah. Uh, so this is the fabric that we're gonna choose from, and then we're gonna have something tailor made. So yeah, this is Siwe. Hi. He's a celebrity in Rwanda, and these are all the rent. Do you want to yeah. tell people oh. in South Africa to come and buy Cape from your shop? Cape Town down. Uh, Cape Town down. Cape Town inside. Do you want to tell people in South Africa to come and buy here? Yeah. Where is this market? Kimirongo market. Kimirongo market in Kigali. In Kigali. 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 Kigali city. Okay. So this. Okay, I didn't tell them. So this is the material. Yeah. That I got. I'm making a dress out of this one, and I'm making a two-piece crop top um, palazzo pants with this one. Kigali Heights. We are at Kigali Heights. Did I crop myself out? No, it's actually very nicely done. Okay. I'll show you the place just now. I'm tired. I'm <laughs> I literally feel like I was run down by a bus. But anyway, there's the restaurant Java Cafe. And it's a really nice modern place. There's Radisson. I think it's by the convention center. So that's that and this is this is like a mall and yeah so just sitting outside. It's two hundred and ten. They work, they're so not on point. <laughs> My name is Didier. Okay. Um, this market is called Chimirongo Market. Chimirongo in Rwanda, in yeah, Kigali. In Kigali. And guys he's really good. I'm gonna show them actually properly when I get home. But he makes things like on the spot and for cheap. And for cheap, you guys. Like cheap, 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 cheap. Look at that. But anyway, I'll show you guys in proper lighting and you shall see. Hello, guys. Welcome. Oh, well, you are in the vlog. But today is the last day that I'm here. And yeah, you guys. Like, it's been a very long trip if i should say so mostly because i was tired and i was working as well i was submitting things it was just a mess but we are here and i'm really really grateful to be here and so you guys would have seen that i didn't check in with you guys a lot i'll just take videos and that is because i was tired most of the time and that i didn't really get time to vlog but yeah, today's another day. The reason I'm so conscious about vlogging is because apparently here, like when you film certain things, police come for you and they make you delete the footage. 
and so i don't want to be in that kind of trouble so i'm just waiting here by the tree this is where we said we are meeting another thing is that once you leave the hotel there's no wi-fi so if you lose people then it becomes a bit of a problem because you can't find them again um yeah but for the most part i'm really happy this is what i'm wearing let me just tell you yesterday i was wearing my my shorts uh, <laughs> my denim shorts you guys and the number of people that just give you stairs so if you're gonna come to Kigali leave your shorts at home because it's so weird though because at night there's like a lot of girls in shorts but during the day darling it's not a thing so just uh, a heads up if you're gonna come here and what's the other thing things are really really cheap they're really really affordable the food for me was not so great um, I don't know I don't know if it's because I was stressed or if it really isn't but it has like a blunt you know taste throughout everything tastes the same they eat a lot of goat meats and I'm getting stairs right now hello, hello. how are you Fine. well thanks um yeah Probably gonna go have breakfast now and then I will check you guys. 